Hello students, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I am going to discuss in brief about the fiber reinforced plastics. Simply, they can be called as FRPs. So, these fiber reinforced plastics are known for their tensile strength along one direction. So, they can be simply prepared by reinforcing the plastic matrix with fiber materials such as glass, carbon, etc. So, these fiber reinforced plastics are known for their tensile strength along one direction and they can be prepared by mixing plastic matrix with the fiber. Coming to the methods of preparation, they can be prepared by using several methods and the most important methods includes matched metal dye molding which is similar to that of compression molding. So, here the plastic matrix is mixed with the fiber by using upper and lower mold with the specified temperature and pressure. Finally, it results in the formation of fiber reinforced plastics. Second one is injection molding. It is quite similar to injection molding technique used for plastics. Hand layup technique and spray up technique mainly used for the preparation of fiber reinforced plastics where the plastic matrix and fiber are applied simultaneously and that results in the formation of fiber reinforced plastics. Coming to the types of fiber reinforced plastics, there are three important types of fiber reinforced plastics. Coming to the first one, it is known as glass fiber reinforced plastic. It is obtained by mixing silica sand with limestone and folic acid. These are the three major ingredients. Finally, it results in the formation of glass fiber reinforced plastics. These glass fiber reinforced plastics are highly useful while manufacturing bridges, aeroplane wings, etc. They are also used in automobile industry and also they are used while designing the circuit boards. Coming to the second category, it includes carbon fiber reinforced plastics. They can be simply obtained by mixing carbon with the plastic matrix. Especially they are highly useful for designing space vehicles, satellites and also used in sports equipment. Coming to the third category, it is called as aramide fiber reinforced plastics they can also be called as bulletproof plastics especially bulletproof plastics can be prepared from bisphenol and phosgene so bisphenol undergoes condensation with phosgene in the presence of alkali like NaOH and it results in the formation of bulletproof plastics especially aramide fiber reinforced plastics are highly useful for designing bulletproof jackets for the manufacturing of goggles safety shields and also for the manufacturing of telephone parts and also they can be used in the manufacturing of CDs and DVDs. If you like the video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.